at six. And thanks for being with us. Some Cottage Grove residents are challenging the speed limit on a section of road in their community. Well, some say they don't know how fast to drive there. We're talking about Baxter Road in the town of Cottage Grove and part in the town of Sun Prairie, running from Cottage Grove Road north until Purseville Road. That's where we find News 3's Jessica Arp. This isn't a very long stretch of road, maybe two miles all the way from beginning to end, but you'd be shocked how many people have gotten speeding tickets here recently. You get to this hill, you keep 35. Those speed violators include Dave Walquist. We had five people in the car that are licensed drivers and everybody said, uh, you got a light out, uh, what's going on? Walquist says in March, while out for a drive to show his daughter a way to her new job, he turned northbound off Cottage Grove Road, drove down Baxter Road, marked three times as 35 miles an hour. He passed the final sign, saw open road ahead, and no more speed signs. As I was coming down the hill, I was speeding up to get up to 55 or whatever uh, speed. And uh, when I got up to just down the road here, the... Uh, officer was sitting in this location and turned on the lights and pulled me over right up here. The Dane County Sheriff's Department tells us they issued 112 tickets here last year and 136 in the first six months of this year alone. Walquist says that's clear in court where he's contesting his ticket. Person after person after person that came in and they said, oh, Baxter Road, oh, Baxter Road, heading northbound. We asked the town board to talk to us about the limit and the signs. The board chair declined, but showed us records showing they had the speed limit lowered to 35 in 1997 until the town line at the interstate. North of that is the town of Sun Prairie, where the limit is 55. It's also not marked. We asked the DOT what the speed limit was. They couldn't say for sure the town road is under town jurisdiction. If they've received multiple complaints. We would typically, you know, do a study you know, if, if one hasn't been done in the past, or even if one has and something's changed, you know, we would definitely go out there, do a study, and see if, if the speed limit is appropriate. What the DOT did say is 35 mile an hour signs are supposed to appear every 1,500 feet. It's clear that's not the case here, and Walquist is asking for more signs or some clarity, knowing he drove this way that day to try and show his daughter a shortcut. So does she drive this way now? No, no, she doesn't. <laughs> Walquist says he's expecting a decision by a judge on whether to hold up the ticket he got here on Baxter Road sometime in the next two weeks. In Cottage Grove, Jessica Arp, WISC News 3.